A giant leap has been taken towards infrastructure development of this nature and magnitude for the first time in India. And one of the key projects undertaken is to solve the emerging need of portable drinking water for this fast-growing cosmopolitan city. This journey began with the inception of CWDL, a subsidiary of CMWSSB along with the expertise of IVRCL at Hyderabad, renowned for infrastructure projects. Chennai's sea beach, being the second largest in the world, has been a blessing in disguise for the project location as an entry point to the city, apt for its expansive land availability for creating a lagoon for trenching sea water and the proximity of the Chennai port for erection and commissioning of this ambitious project. The first phase of the project was commenced with dredging operations and also sinking of pipes at appropriate levels to receive the seawater through coordinates into the trench. Once the prescribed levels were achieved in the trench, HDPE pipes of 1600 mm diameter were laid. precautionary measure, five HDPE pipes of 560 mm diameter have also been sunk and a lagoon has been formed. The water thus trapped is then transferred for dosing to clean, remove impurities and reduce acidity. Automated electrical panels are in place to control the speed of motors and dosing quantities to obtain correct proportions and effective monitoring. VFT and PLC controls are placed to verify the operating conditions of the high pressure pumps. Next, the water is made to pass through gravity settlers to remove tiny dust particles and the water in the top surface only is passed on to the next stage of gravity sand filtration. Sand media and anthracite media are employed to remove dust particles and foul odor from the water. It is collected in tanks through GS filters and gives pressure to PS filters. A further purification process is carried out by use of cartridge filters, fine filters, to achieve a particle size of less than 5 microns of total suspended solids. It is ensured that SDI water below 5 microns is only allowed to the next stage of reverse osmosis. High pressure pumps coordinated with SCADA software controls are employed to pass water to the membranes in order to remove salt particles. The SCADA software controls and monitors all the desalination operations of the plant. A state-of-the-art chemical lab has been set up for testing the purity of water at various stages right up to the final product to ensure specifications of portability and a pH of 7.5. The portable water is stored in two huge tanks having capacity to hold one crawl liters in each. As this water has been demineralized as an inbuilt process, a further treatment of lime and carbon dioxide is added to improve the water's mineral strength. Sodium hypochlorite is added as a preservative. For uninterrupted power supply, an 11 kV substation is in place for all power requirements of the entire project.